Welcome back, friendarinos, to Dirty Be Playing Persona. Wow, I did it again. That's funny. Welcome back, friendarinos, to Dirty Be Playing Nosia. So, let us be a guardian angel and not fuck up as hard as I fucked up like those last few games. Like, I I'm not gonna try to play that many games in a row as late as I am playing right now. I'm gonna do one game and see if it's just generally better quality than most of that whole last recording that was the last, I don't know, five, six episodes or something like that. Anyway, <clears throat> at the record show, we now begin our answer Nosian venture or pro Nosian, depending on who I am in this case, either Jonas or Nosian Jonas or Bob Jonas, perhaps, or perhaps I may even a C follower, Jonas, you have no idea, because that's how this game is. The circumstances are vague, you see, just like I said, and our chances are, well, let's just do it. I love his dialogue so much, and how quirky and interesting he is. He's a good character, a really well thought out, interesting, and spooky character that has some very questionable interests and is, I mean, they keep making it clear that he's certifiably insane, so, oh boy. I'm just gonna go ahead and... Oh wait, hold on, no, I'm the guardian angel. I was I was about to be like, I'm gonna step forward, but you can't do that as a guardian angel. So I'm just gonna have other people do the step forwardy thing, because that's usually smart anyway. You urge the engineer to come forward. Let us have the engineer, engineer support. I can investigate one person overnight. I can tell whether they're no or not, or are you? Maybe not. Hey, that's, there's only one engineer on this ship, and that engineer's me. So Gina Remnant or Shigamichi. So we've got probably an ASO C follower bug in the mix, because as far as I'm aware, so far, at least in this playthrough, I've not experienced two Nosia trying to claim the same role. But don't quote me on that. So we'll see. Hey, hold up! The engineer's me! Gina and Remnant stop lying! <laughs> I wore over the position of engineer! Thanks, all of you! This will help weed out the Nosia. Well, not really. It kind of makes it more hard to do so, in my opinion. In my... In my, uh, experience, Rakio, but, you know, obviously you're cocky and think you're the smartest person alive who can do anything. And that's not even... It's not, that's not true at all, but, yeah. Um, definitely fits their character to say that. Hey, I'm good at using the pronoun good now. Yay, it feels good. So they won't have to kill me. Yeah, guard, doctor. Guard duty will come least, because it's the last one on the list, just because. And then I will shut up, because I said three things already. You're the doctor to come forward. Forgot to mention it, but I'm the doctor. If whoever goes in the cold sleep is Nosia, I'll know. You made a bad call, Chippy. Making an enemy of me, the only true doctor on this ship. Oh, God, three and three. Oh, boy. That's fun. Um, I hope you can all believe me, but the doctor isn't Rakio and Chippy, it's me. Clearly the dialogue is, you know, like, piece- it's like, it's made so that pieces can be inserted. So like, you know, that is there doesn't really line up with the fact that there's two people, it would have been R. It is oh, actually wait no I'm not sure exactly what the grim grammar change would have been or if there really would be would have been one but regardless I feel like there are definitely situations in this game where that ends up being the case and the grammar's a bit mad because they just cut and paste different things in there and oftentimes plural where there should be singular and singular where there should be plural I'm sure but regardless guard duty who y'all you were the guard duty to come forward who y'all guard duty um I have not been infected by Nosia. I stayed on the ship doing research when we docked. Oh, that's right. Stella had also remained aboard the ship. We can be sure there is no risk of Nosy infection there. So Yuriko and Stella in this case. And as far as everyone else, we have three people saying they're engineer, three people saying they are doctor. The engineers to go over it for mo more, more me than you. <laughs> because I am the one having to figure out who the hell is Nosy and who ain't, you know. Uh, the engineers are Shigamichi, Gina, Remnant, uh, and the doctors are Otome, Chippy, and Rakio. Hopefully I'll start being able to read them out, and I'll definitely do my best to make use of their reports, as well as the number of Nosy and uh, crew we, we have in order to try to figure out who's bullshitting their reports. SQ. So this is actually, like, kind of fun. 
I get like all this turkey time and stuff. Oh my god, turkey, let's like totally team up and survive, okay? Let's see. SQ isn't among any of these groups, but she could very well be Nosia. But in case she isn't, I think it's smart. But I've definitely been strung along by her being Nosia before, so I think I will refuse. I think it's generally smarter to do so if they try to cling to you immediately. I can manually ask her for... Actually, no. What I can do is I can come to her at night if I've, like, proven in some way that she was probably human, maybe? I don't know, but... Regardless, um... I won't doubt to cover anyone, I'll just kinda keep going. It's the way Durgy, like, keeps talking. This is why I just didn't say anything. It's just, like, super sketchy. How? Uh, I just refused you, but uh, SQ? Did I do it? So you like, what, my help? Dirky, but you're like totally so sketch? Oh jeez, oh boy, oh god, oh god, oh Jesus. Maybe that was a bad call, like asking her, and I just- I feel like that's a low chance thing anyway. I might be fucked, and I'm definitely human, but I might have made some people think I ain't- What? <laughs> Who the hell is like generally? I don't know. I wish you could randomize this for moments like this. Like a random button to push that it selects for you. You know, obviously excluding people that are proven to be human and who are guards. It's probably possible, but yeah. Um... <sighs> hmm. I feel like SQ is generally suspicious. Is anyone gonna vote for me? Um, yeah, okay, hold on. No, oh, yeah, ah, oh, fuck, that's embarrassing. I think, yeah, starting off with... Okay, everyone is a bad idea. But if people don't immediately do that, maybe then it's safe to do it again. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a pretty high chance that that happens. I think it also... It's because my charisma's lower, right? Ah, Otome hug. That's a whoops. That's a doof. But I did level from that somehow. Uh, but again, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep cycling because this is fun. Though I might want to stick on one at some point in order to. Here's the reason. In order to. Uh, by the way, wait. Did I bump it down to four? I want to keep it the maximum because I'm an idiot. I don't know. Be oh, okay. I'm trying never to say I'm an idiot or say anything like that because I just feel like that's generally not a good idea or a good thing to joke about, and it just it destroys my self-esteem to even consider that or to hear people say that. It doesn't destroy my self-esteem to hear people say, "Oh, I'm stupid. I'm an idiot," but it really makes me hurt for them. Because oftentimes I'm pretty sure they believe it, at least in some way, if they're joking about that. And that's not healthy. That sucks to believe that. And what I've found is that I believe it less nowadays, in fact, very little, because I feel like the main factor was I eliminated saying that to myself as much as I could. So, yeah, I champion that. Don't say you're stupid, okay? Even if you feel it. It's just not good. It's gonna just compound feeling stupid. That's in my that's been my experience anyway. And regardless of if that's really true or not, if I look at it objectively, I just it just doesn't feel good to me to hear people say they're stupid or to call myself stupid. So I try not to. All I know is I used to, and it's just not fun. Uh, and you can you can just decide not to say that, and then eventually you won't even believe it as much anymore. That's been my experience, so I'm gonna keep championing it. Okay, thankfully at this point I don't have to worry about being sketch. Actually, do I? I don't know. Either way, I'll come forward as guard duty, and then I'll shut up this time. Oh hey, special start. So it's here after all. <laughs> Thus begins the feast of insanity. Hmm. How shall we handle Nosia infectees? How indeed. Let us run together with the proverbial flow, like leaves on a rushing river. So you're saying as captain I'm going to do nothing then? Well, even I, Jonas, cannot be sure whether I am Nosia or not. No one knows anything at this point. <laughs> Why would I ask at that point? Durgi, my honored guest. I wish to speak further with you, but alas, once this is all over, let us raise a glass and triumph! Jonas, what should I? Ah, uh, you would do best to act like another passenger. Yeah, see, now we start to learn about Stella here. However, I would like you to continue to maintain this ship, of course. Understood. I will do as you say. 
At any rate, we are all slaves to fate! We have but to fulfill the rules we have been given. I love Jonas, he's so interesting. And also, I really love Stella, she's also interesting. And also, like, there's that thing earlier where we had sex, but, you know, like... Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's gonna go ahead and get the fact that I'm guard duty out of the way. And so is... Satsu! Yes, Darky is not Nosia. Darky and I remained on the ship, and can vouch for each other. Any objections? No. Yay. And let's just let everyone else do their thing unless people do not step forward. Yeah, instant doubting is a bit... I'm just gonna let this all pass. I think it's generally a good idea. Now I'm going to ask another person to step forward. This is how I normally will handle this now. I think it will be at least safer. Engineer. It's always best to try to get in all three of those, but not all in a row because you're gonna be more likely to be called out for talking too much, so. The engineer is akin a shri- akin- it should be akin to, oh well, a shrine maiden controlling the ship's nerve center. For all of your sakes, I shall seek out the Nosia. As much as I will grammar Nazi all over these games, I recognize as a writer that writing things grammatically correctly is a lot harder than it might seem until you reread your own stuff later and you're like, wait, how the f how did I do that? Because there's probably proofreading involved in the process of making a game like this. There's no way there isn't, right? But it's so hard to let things like that slip. So I don't really blame these people. And also, it's kind of funny to point out, so I, I, I don't even think it's a bad thing. As long as you can understand what's going on. If it's, like, poorly translated, then that's, that's the point where dialogue's a problem. But, like, if there's some little mistakes, it's just kind of fun. Because usually you can understand what's what, what the character is saying or what is being told to you as the player by the game with a few mistakes here and there. Oh, uh, sorry, but... I too, or rather, I am the engineer. Same goes for even typos and books and stuff. Hey, there's only one engineer on the ship, that engineer's me, oh boy. Wait, hold on, is that four? Or three? Hey, hold on, the engineer's me, Chippy Remnant, oh wait, yeah, it's four. Okay, yeah, I knew there was four sometimes. Oh boy. Something isn't right here, so this one engineer is the most we've had pile up in claims, at least in this Let's Play. Now, thankfully, well, slash non thankfully, because four is still ridiculous. Four is the not, is the top number that I have uh, ever seen. I don't think I've seen five plus, and maybe I have, and maybe I will, and I, I really hope I don't. But I'm pretty sure I've only seen four, so I don't think I can go higher than this. But still, it's gonna get confusing, folks. I'm gonna do my best to not pick up like a bin anyway. Alright, um, maybe I really need a different set of skills, but again, I'm gonna deal with that stuff when I'm next to Bug and change my stuff with Yuriko. I'm gonna go ahead and once again, let doubt happen, I guess. Again, I usually don't know who to doubt in the first, and I don't think you should really, like, point fingers unless you know someone's lying or something. You know, when you're not Nosia. When you are Nosia, you have a bit more of a better idea of what you should be doing. I feel, actually. If anyone goes, go save, so... Oh, doctor, please believe me. Once it starts getting... So, let's see here. I'm gonna say, who was the first one that called out anyone? Oh, dang. Well, yeah, I don't have much intelligence at all, no wonder. Yeah, there's not gonna be much of a log. Or not intelligence, what is it? Is it... Um... Logic? Yeah, the one that's, like, more intel... The most intelligence-like is, like, intelligence meaning the stat from, like, other RPGs. Like, you know, Western RPGs. Like, you know, D&D &D and stuff is where it originated, as far as I'm aware. That trend of intelligence being the name of a stat that usually has to do with, like, your logic-based skills and that kind of a thing. Uh, and oftentimes it has to do with magic and, like, you know, uh, fantasy settings and stuff, so, yeah. Anyway, thank you, Alright, uh, who was the first one that spoke up? Yeah, Comet, and also Yuriko said she, or Setsu said she was. She very well might have been lying, because she's bad at it. Setsu very well might have detected that. So I'm going to go ahead and say that Comet's suspicious. Comet should go. Yeah, most people look, I, I think she was lying then. Oh, Rakio too. Interesting. Hmm, maybe they were both lying. Again, I'm not going to know unless I you know, have high, uh, perception, which I haven't this whole game so far, this whole particular playthrough. But again, I have more reason to doubt Comet, so. 
I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna exaggerate. And of course, you know, like I said, yeah, I no, mm, there we go, barely, but we did. And then I think I might as well rack you it up, but who knows, man. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking Rakio is also a close second. Uh, but first I will level, because that's a free action, and I don't spend time doing that. Charisma. Uh, maybe charm. I think like 20 charm does something, doesn't it? I think so. Durgy, I'm scared. I've served Jonas on this ship for quite some time, and speaking from experience... When Jonas is in a pleasant mood, he usually signals that something unpleasant is going to occur. It began when we saved the evacuees on Liyuan. He's been acting strange ever since. I'm sure he's planning something untoward. That or it's possible he's been infected by the Nosia. Please, Dergy, be careful. Interesting. Oh boy. You can feel Kakushka mourning for Setsu. It's my turn to port. Still is human, just like me. Connects from Fat Nosia. Still, uh, who knows? By the way, we do have a guardian angel, right? Yeah, I didn't fuck with any of the rules. I thought so. I just, uh, just unfortunately didn't pick Setsu last time. I feel it's time to reveal the results of my investigation. I wonder what, like, the AI prioritizes. Like, if it was deciding to protect the guard duty, it could only flip a coin, I guess, and protect, you know, one of the two, so, you know, there's a very good chance if you're trying to protect the guard duty people that you might pick the wrong one. And then also, again, there's freaking four engineers this time, right? Yeah. Thankfully, there's only two doctors. I feel it's time to reveal the results of my investigation. Rakio showed no signs of invest- of blah blah blah. Nothing significant whatsoever. I eye checked on someone else. Xiao Ming. Xiao Ming is Nosia. I have a feeling and Nosia wouldn't just call bluff and try to make someone else Nosia more- I don't know, man. And again, Rakio's already suspicious, so. I also feel like we should expect Jonas to be Anosia, but... Or at least something. I report. I examined Cold Sleeper yesterday. Results turned out negative for Anosia. Comet was a human. Hmm. Wait a minute. Hmm. For the purpose of this story, I feel like Stella's probably the real doctor? But I feel like with everything we've got, we should probably doubt Jonas and doubt. I think we should get Jonas doubted. Hmm, Yuriko agrees, Stella agrees, obviously. Okay, I think we might have done it. And then next time, if we get him cold slept, I'll focus on Rakio for now. Unless I have more reason to suspect someone is specifically something. No see a bug. Although, like, expecting, suspecting someone is specifically you no know, see a bug or AC follower is a bit trickier than, you know. That. Also, yeah, I need to really be careful of, of the engineers reports, especially when they start to pile up after a few days. I will check those while I make my decision for who to who to slip. Especially if it's like, I don't know, a guard duty or something. Oh, why did I do that? I, I do kind of actually suspect her, but yeah, <laughs> it's kind of funny. I'm glad. I will also, actually, I will shut up for now. Especially because, yeah, I still agree with that. Huh, people actually trust Rakio, that's weird, because they really wanted her gone the first time. Alright, easy. Oh, hold on, I'm guard duty, so I don't even need to do that. All right. I was like, why is it not giving me the option? It's because I'm guard duty. I'm already, I've already been proven. Hmm. And because I have no intuition, I will not. But if a lot of people start voting for one person, I think I'll go with them. But unfortunately, because I have no intuition, I will not see someone lying. But certainly, at some point, I will have higher intuition. And you will be able to see, at some point, randomly, um, what it looks like. There's a nice little cool effect when you see someone lying. And it's neat. I'm 
equipped to show that off. Maybe even next loop. I'll just kind of feel into whatever I want to jack up for whatever reason when I am bug next. Good work. Now we know whom to doubt, do we not? Those who refuse to declare their humanity. Gina didn't claim to be human. Yep, I think that's curtains for her then. And next, I think I might get Gina. And yeah, like, for this scenario, it makes the most sense that if, if Stella's human, so... I'm gonna believe that she is the real doctor. And hope that doesn't bite me in the ass. I don't think it will in this particular scenario, too. So a lot of times this scenario and the implications thereof will help you with certain rules. And it's interesting because these are like the story, you know, sections that, that move the story forward. And they actually tend to be easier because of things like this. It's interesting. I'm gonna dream of you all. A lot of people are very divided. It's probably because of all the doubt being thrown around everywhere. And I was, <laughs> I was pretty responsible for that. Whoops. Hello, Jonas. Oh boy. Oh yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? There are priceless items stored here. I'd appreciate your restraint in carelessly entering this place. What is here? Yes, Jonas. What sort of things are stored here? Twas curiosity to kill the cat, as they say. That's not scary at all. Yeah, I kid. It's mostly liquor, some odd collectibles. Ancient earth relics, various works of art, etc. Now allow me to question you, Dergy. So tell me, how do you regard Stella? She's kind. And Stella's a kind person. Kind, and did you know that kindness is sometimes a way to deceive an enemy? Stella was originally sent to me by the government, for the purpose of acting as both my assistant and watcher. She's been with me for a long time now, interesting. However, there are parts of her that are simply unknowable. I often sense something strange in her recently. But what could she be thinking under the mask of hers? We'll book them in five minutes. All crew members, please return to your rooms. I have been faster than I expected. Well then, Durgy, goodbye. Hope to see you again. Or do you? Maybe you'll have to see me and then kill me because you're nosy. Durgy, I hate to be seen as intrusive, but please don't worry too much about what Jonas said. He is indeed a hero of the age of space exploration, but that was long ago. Now he simply wanders space with no objective nor destination. His behavior often causes trouble for those around him. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be saying such things, but even as an AI, I can tell you that it would be in your best interest to avoid him. He has been officially recognized by the Space Federation as insane. Mikeo disappeared. Okay, so they are cleared as... They might have been an AC follower, though. Or a bug, so... They might have also not been. Kruska! Jonas. Pretty... Darn, considering the scenario. Ready to believe Yuriko on that one. SQ. An ultimate. I have a feeling Yuriko might be the real one in this case. A lot of times it's not going to be that easy to, like, basically know that, but, like, considering this scenario, it makes too much damn sense, right? Although it really might have just been to learn about Jonas, and he may not be Nosia this time. But Stella did say it was a possibility, so... He's in this cold sleep. Stella, yep. No, so yeah, I'm pretty damn sure that she must be the right one. That Stella must be the right uh, doctor, I mean. And that we're on the right track, so... Let's once again start doubting Jonas! There we go. I think Yuriko's the real one. Hmm. Hmm. I think we got him. Yepper. Yerushka. Hmm. Shaming's lying. I think she might be right. Hmm. But she also very well may be one of the fake engineers. Hmm. Well, she might not be. Oh boy. Yep, she just beardled. Oh boy, boy, boy. But yeah, she was definitely the real doctor. 
remnant SQ who's gonna know see hmm I'm pretty yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and just randomly you me cheat up I should probably be looking at the engineer files. Hold on. I'm gonna do that. Let's see who else to doubt here. Okay, so Yuriko said Jonas was. Yuriko said Raikei was human and they died. I think she's the real one. And Yuriko also said Kakrushka, so I think everyone else ain't it. You know what? Yeah, Kakrushka isn't among them. And she is the one that told me that it was Shaming that was lying. I think I think that's very possible. Also, I think Remnant could be it too, interestingly enough, I think. I think Chippy is also a fake. Yeah, I think Shaming is lying. I think Jeskew's human. I'll go ahead and get him doubted too. But, uh, first off, I will vote for Shigemichi, then I think I'll focus on Shaming. We shall see, baby, hecky, get out of those meds. Wow. Ah, I'll, I'll trust her. I have no reason to believe she's no see or anything right now. Actually, wait. Yeah, no. Yeah, she ain't. An engineer or, or a doctor, so yeah. Here you go. Ah. Ah, fish festival with Otome. Yeah, delicious. Nom. I do tend to like seafood, so fuck yeah. I do like seafood quite a bit in general, I would say, so fuck yeah. Excuse sound. Yep, I knew. Yeah, at this point, hold on. People said she was Nosia. Those people are provably wrong. Can I? No, I don't think I can definite enemy for some reason. I think Shigemichi was the one since I, I, I think I might have been able to. Uh, hold on. Um. Either way. Um. All right. So okay. No. No one. Let's see. Yeah. Chippy said SQ was Nosia, and she did. So interesting. I can't definite enemy him. No, I think it's because I don't have the logic anymore. Don't quote me. There we go. Yeah, I just don't have the logic. She was able to do it. There we go. We've got that. Let's go ahead and sow seeds of doubt for any other engineers other than Eureka. I don't think, yeah, Remnant can't be it either. But then there's also, Shaming is, I think Shaming is right. Is like, definitely. Woofle. Gonna vote for Chippy. Oh, I think I might have preferred. Oh, wow. <laughs> and even if Xiaoming says it. Well, I mean, well. Um, well, say that. Both of them, you know what? Honestly, either or is fine. I think they're both equally suspicious. I will vote for Chippy, but I think Xiaoming's getting it. No, okay. Looks like mine sort of won out, I guess. Oh, I think, oh god, oh boy. Oh boy, I think she's a bug. Yapper. Ah, it was Yuriko. Ah, dang. So the real one was, oh man, the real one was Shigemichi. Ah, how, wait. Yeah, okay, wow, oh, oh, we were, ah, man. 
We did get two, though. We did get Jonas. Yeah, he was. And then Gina. And, oh, and we did, we did get three. Three out of six. But oof, oh, man. Yeah, winning these is hard with the settings I've got. But I really want to figure it out and do it. Um, and the more I play the game, I think the better I'll get at that. But ye, I'll call that a session. I hope y'all have lovely days. Like, comment, subscribe if you'd like to. And I will see y'all in my next one, friend arenas. Hell yeah.